guys. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Today we are here to review Suzuki Boulevard M109R. The boss. The bike looks amazing. It's a little bit heavy, but the bike itself is just amazing. It has 1789cc engine and it comes with two exhausts on the side. Engine is quite heavy, it's got quite big and it gives you the look of uh, cruiser, it gives you a classic cruiser look and as you can see the bike itself is just amazing. So let us ride this one and see how far this bike can take us. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. How are you all today? As you know, today is a very special day for me because I have one of the best cruiser in town. Boulevard M109R, the boss. As you know, boss is always right. And really this thing is just unbelievably powerful. And uh, really I just don't know how to say this, but this thing is just as powerful as you can see a car. So right now I'm sitting on 1800cc motor power. Engine sound is just amazing. It just very it has very nice tone to it. Currently it has it has a stock uh, muffler or stock exhaust you can say and it's it has a very nice sound into it and I'm really feeling it just like you know it's something tuned very nicely. So once you listen to your favorite music you feel like you are listening to one you want to. So this is what this sound is about. I really I don't have any word to explain that how this sound affects me right now I really love it I really love the feel of it you know it's you you can just do like this you feel like you have a power so here you go oh <laughs> Power of a horse! Whoa! You just want to jump out of your hand! Wow! This is what I'm talking about, man. This is the power I've been looking for. And I think you will love it also. It's a cruise bike, but it gives you the power and feel of a sports bike. And then you have a comfort in your hand, and it's like you are just one of driving one of the best bikes currently in the town. Really, I really I'm really enjoying the bike. Currently I own a Harley, but Harley does not give me this feel the feel I'm getting from Suzuki. In today's video, we're going to talk about engine, dimensions, chassis, drivetrain and electrical. All this five part will be covered in this video. Let us talk about engine first. The main thing. The engine capacity on that is 1783cc, 4 stock engine with liquid cool technology and it's a V twin engine. And you know what it means, more power and more torque. This thing has serious torque option on it. It goes 0 to 60 in just 3.65 seconds and I have tested man and it generates 105 horsepower. Wow. Let us talk about dimension, the most important thing for a rider. Overall length for this bike is 2450mm or 96.5 in inches and overall width for this bike is 875mm or 34.4 inches. Ground clearance on this one is 130 millimeter or 5.1 inches from the ground and the seat height is 705 millimeter or 27.8 inches. Also you can add a second seat. You just need to remove a cover 
and you can have an extra accessory for extra seat. Bike weight is 347 kg but still I was able to handle it very nicely even on the turns. Some people might face issue while standing with the bike. You need to go to gym. Now we will talk about chases. So front side we have inverted telescope suspension that is beautifully crafted in aluminium shock cover and then we have disc brake twin on the front side and then the front tire size is 180 by 70 r18 and then you have this rear tire of 240 by 40 r18 to give you good grip on the road Clutch is also a very important part for the motorbike. If clutch is not responsive, you cannot enjoy the bike the way you want. This bike has multi-plate clutch type and it's just amazingly responsive. And then you have a 5-speed gearbox on it. And then finally, the final drive, you are getting the shaft drive. Shaft drive is way better than the belt drive because it is more responsive. And for this bigger bike, it is more, more and more accurate to give you the power electrical wise this bike is just to keep as a vintage or as a classic cruiser bike so Suzuki is not giving you any major update on the electrical ways for example there is no keyless entry you still have to put the key near the engine and you have even a handle lock imagine we are in 2020 and we are you're getting two meters with this bike. First meter will show you the fuel indicator, speedometer, clock and odometer. And then we go to the second meter where we have gear indicator, we have RPM, we have heat temperature and neutral light. In Qatar, one of the best thing when you meet a kid on the road, he always love the bikers all the kids they love the bikes so guys this this was my review about m109 r the boss and it's just amazing bike it's very responsive and very nice even though it's a big engine and and very very big bike but once you once you drive the bike on the road you feel very lightweight and it's it's just going with the flow and it's very very balanced bike i hope you like the video if you have any question, you can ask me in the comment section. And in the end, I would like to thank the Seal Motor to give me this bike for the review. If you have any question, you can ask me in the comment section or else you can visit the Seal Motor showroom near the airport road. Thank you very much. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Azam out.